And once again, welcome into Flash University. Now this time we're talking about the FTS 371 Vanguard Red LED series. This LED system is designed to meet FAA and IKO lighting standards and comes equipped with a single dry contact for alarm monitoring. The 371 can operate one red LED beacon and up to four LED side markers. The system will come pre-programmed from the factory, but that can be very easily changed via the configuration switches and jumpers found in the controller. The 371 controller also comes equipped with replaceable fuses, configuration options for flashing or steady burn markers, and alarm LEDs to assist with troubleshooting and lighting inspections. Now let's take a closer look at the connection points on the controller board. The input voltage can be supplied with AC or DC voltage depending on the system type that is formally ordered. The AC input systems will accept a range of 85 to 265 volts AC at 50 to 60 hertz, and the DC powered systems can accept a positive 24 or 48 volts DC. The flash head will connect to J2 of the controller board, however if installing a DC input system, it is critical to ensure the voltage supplied to the controller matches the flash head's input voltage to avoid system damage. Verify this by checking the sticker found on the inside of the flash head. The markers will connect to J3. Ensure the white-blue wires connected to the position labeled Sense for proper alarming. The mode change device, called the photodiode, will connect to J4 on pins 4, 5, and 6. In addition to the controller features, the LED flash head comes equipped with the intelligence to operate as a standalone flash head. This means that with the addition of a powered photo cell, the flash head can work without the use of a lighting controller. Utilizing the configuration switches in the flash head, you can adjust the flash rate, burst duration, and the appropriate FAA or IKO settings. Well, that's our close-up look at the 371 controller and flash head. Don't forget to visit flashtechnology.com under products for additional system information and to request a formal quote.